Welcome to Black and Gold Today, brought to you by Ray Brandt Infinity. I'm Rachel Whitaker. The Saints and Pelicans ownership saga continues, so let's begin. Joining me now is Fox 8 Saints reporter Sean Fazan. How's it going, Sean? Doing great. <laughs> well, you come back from the Senior Bowl to a controversy that now includes a lawsuit filed against Tom Benson by his family, uh, asserting that he's incompetent to run his sports and business empire worth over a billion dollars. So this takes the dissension to a whole new level. No doubt about it. I can't say it was a surprise to, to, to see the counter move, if you will, mm -hmm. uh, by the Benson or slash LeBlanc family, because as mm -hmm. we found out today, she's now going by Rita LeBlanc, not Benson LeBlanc anymore. Mm -hmm. um, just because, look, when you have this big, this big of a move with this much money involved, this is going to drag on. It's not. You're not just going to walk away without a fight. So uh, I expected the move. We had heard rumblings of the possible ownership shakeup for a couple of weeks now, and obviously uh, it was broken uh, early this week by your colleague uh, Jeff Duncan. So mm -hmm. uh, I, I think the lesson here is stay tuned because this is going to drag out. And if you're a fan of of a lot of money, wealthy families, a lot of dirty laundry, it's going <laughs> you're going to get all of that uh, pretty soon over the next. Who long? Who long? Who knows how long it'll actually take? But uh, I think uh, stay tuned. This thing's far from finished. Exactly. I definitely agree with you. And let's watch Fox 8's quick talk with Benson this morning as he and Gail drove to team headquarters. Hey, good. How are you? What are you doing out in this bad weather? <laughs> Being very cold this morning. <laughs> how are you feeling this morning? Great. Just like um, a 50-year-old. <laughs> how about that, huh? Can't beat that deal. Okay. I'll put in a good day's work for a good day's pay. <laughs> I know you said in your statement last night that you would be here at work today. What, what are you focusing on right now? Well, we're getting ready for the season. And it starts now, you know, and that's the football season. And we still got the Pelicans going to have to go a long way, so we're quite busy. That's why I'm here, <laughs> instead of being on my boat. <laughs> And Gail drove them away with no comment on the suit. So again, stay tuned. A yeah. lot more to come. And we'll actually go to a lighter subject when we come back with Saints Trivia. Affordable luxury is here at the Ray Brandt Infinity Pre-Owned Center. Over 100 of the world's finest luxury cars and trucks are on sale. Infinity, Acura, BMW, Mercedes-Benz, Lexus, Porsche, Land Rover, Jaguar, and more. All within reach. And special low luxury financing rates makes it easy to buy. Affordable luxury is here at Ray Brandt Infinity of Metairie Pre-Owned Center. 3700 North Causeway Boulevard, Metairie. Welcome back. Well, this week's trivia question came the day before Benson's ownership transfer and read, The Saints had a record five players in the Pro Bowl in 1980. Name one of the four offensive players and the lone defensive player they sent. And those players were Wes Chandler, Henry Childs, Archie Manning, Chuck Muncie, who was the MVP of the game, and the loaned defensive player with safety, Tommy Myers. Uh, many of you noted all five, so very nice. And Sean, let's do it again. And out of the helmet, draw another winner. <laughs> all right, here we go. It is Jerry Redden. Uh, oh, he didn't tell us where he was from. Didn't tell us where he was from, but Jerry Redden. Congratulations. Jerry, okay, yes. We're again giving away a Drew Brees plaque, so congratulations, Jerry. And don't miss our last trivia question of the season next week. Well, Sean, thanks a lot for the insight. Ooh, thank you. And thank you for wrapping up your week with us. We'll see you on Monday.